probably too. I'm just doing an update. I haven't done one in a while. No, I'm doing a lot of projects now. I just got back in the mood. I'll just, I guess I'll start this motor. I finally got the damn piston out. It, I cleaned up a little bit. Need to clean a little more. I got some uh, purple power. It's like four bucks extra supply. Forty, I think the forty ounce. I set it on there, but forget it. It's a forty ounce. It's like a value. It's like four bucks. And um, you can see you can see the whole pump mechanism. It's because it looked like that, but white. And I um dropped it right over there. When I was getting off my shelf. But it still works, it just doesn't, you know, look as neat. So yeah, I was like, shit, I broke, I thought I almost broke it, but nope. Then, um, um, these tank things ideas, I got them, like, all up. These, uh, the compound, like, this I did, like, a day or two ago. The compound's still wet. I'm gonna let it, I just put, I had all this, then I ran out of parts. I had, ran, I didn't have, um, these little nipples. So I had to, um, I went to the store today and get them. I'm going to let them, like, sit over, like, the week. And I'll get back them on Sunday. Work on that one. I'm just done. Just have to tighten it down. I have to get another one of these, uh, recoils. And what's the idea? I'm going to clean up under there and sh shove them. It's a little hard to see, but I'm going to shove them up under that workbench. Yeah, sort of. Get my little mag light with the LED upgrade. And see, you see, it? I'm, it's a shelf I'm just going to clean up all up under there. I'm going to put them back there and get them away. And then I'm going to have this one of these recoil hoses. I'm going to use this one to get a nice craftsman. It's a little Campbell Hossfield. And this, that's going to go in. Yeah, that's going to go in there. And it's going to connect on the back of that. And then I'm going to have another one. It's going to hook into the compressor. Wait, that's going to go in that. And it's going to go in the back of that. And then that's that's going to have another hose, which is going to be this red one. It's, it's a little complicated, but I'll show you when it works. It should probably be in about a week or so. So I'm the compound is set up before I put like 130 PSI. Um, Nobody knows what this is, but... I got myself a tractor, it's a nine horse, and I kind of like sold some parts and he sells the rest of them. The engine parts, it got a bolt stuck in the head. I'm going to drill it out and re-thread it, and then the flywheel nut is stuck and I cut this shit all up and I still got to cut up. So I have to buy a new crankshaft, and I'm just going to buy like piston rings. I'll get that running, I don't know what I'm going to use it for. Then I'm going to paint it. I got some, uh... Got some. Uh... Oh yeah, I took the cap off. Um, this is green. It's lime green. I jumped on the cap here. I'll show you the cap. Uh, Ali's is the place to get on. If you guys two bucks, look at it. Um, two bucks. That is a good deal. That's where I get most of my engine in that board. Oh, and they also sell. It's a three-step kit. These are what, 59 cents? It's this color. It's like, um, it's like a change color type thing. For your, forget what you call them. That is fell. Oh, I need to paint the inside of that. that. Let my friend do a paint job. Fucking blew at it. It's all runny and shit over too much. I was like, ah, fuck. So we do that, I have to do it back. I have to hang it. Got a couple of things hanging from my bike. Got to sand that. Um, that muffler. It's all. It's all on that motor. I'm probably gonna sell it on Craigslist, like five bucks. Just make a little money. I got a lot of stuff in these. Oh, I got this bike chain today. Just throw it out. Shit. It's the. Um, it's like the Bell unicycle. It's like six bucks at Walmart. And th I think. It might need to take a link out, I'm not sure. And it had a master link, right? So I took just the chain out and I threw it back in. And I was like, shit, yeah, there has to be a master link because there's no master link on there. And I picked up the package and good thing the master link was still in there. 
So yeah, that's it. And this house where we get my paint you might see in a lot of my videos. It's 3M Automotive Refinish Masking Tape. It's by 3M. It's kind of say, but it's two box. It's called Ollie's. NASCAR Performance. Here's some of the um, specs, if you want to say. I bought two of them. And they sell caliper paint instead of 15 bucks for the um, caliper cleaner. And you get a home try this, really. And you get, you know, you get a little half pint size. That's where I got that yellow. And you get car cleaner, you get a little mask, you get a little bit of mask tape, a brush, and a mixer. And it's like 15 bucks at Pet Boys. You can get a five bucks there. But the thing is, my place, they only sell one color. Oh, that's also where I got this. Rusty Mail Primer. Had to put some thinner. 229. Had to put some thinner in it because it was like freaking goo. And I got that. Got. If you're wondering where I get most of my flat, my um, paints, I got that. I got black in there. The Rust Oleum, flat black, flat white, and I got this Gloss Hunter Green today. If you're wondering where I get them, I get them at Walmart. It's like three bucks a can. And well, I got every color except for like aluminum brush. I cut aluminum brush, but I don't really want to do it. Spray gun's getting dirtier and dirtier. I'm almost out. Pick some up today. Oh, right, anybody want to see that piston I pulled out? Well, that's for my blow torches and shit. This piston's freaking gouged up on here. That's how much hitting I did to it. I put a hole, a hole, a pl it's like a plus sign hole. I put another one, oh, I put another one. Oh, those are not black spots, or wait, hold on. Oh, there's black spots. So I put a hole, that's how much I hammered on this. I'm going to buy a whole new assembly. Here's the one off that tractor. I'm a retard. Yeah, looks good. I'm just going to get some new rings, some new compression ring. I need a new car. I need like a lot of new carburetor shit. Here's part of the old chain off of the bike. Oh, I want to see if they're the same size. Hey, look. It's rusted. Had to cut that off. Oh, what's that? Oh. I was gonna say. Oh yeah. I don't know what he knows. Oh yeah, I got this um got my frame, put a little primer. I don't know. Look at this. I use like a hundred pieces of tape. Just to do a sprocket. It's like a sixty tooth sprocket or some shit like that. I'm just gonna put truck bed liner. Like three I'm gonna put like four coats of it, cause like the third coat gets texture, and the fourth coat's just, you know, all good. Pick up some paint. Oh shit. I hate this thing. Look at this thing. It's, I keep getting caught. There you go. Throw it behind there. I got some paint thinner. Here's a little trick. Well, I don't know. It's this little tip I'll give you. This is 12 like 50 or something. It's like 1229 or something like that. At my local Sears hardware. And they sell the same brand in a quart. For like, I think it's eight bucks, twelve bucks. You know, it's four bucks more, and you get three times more because it's four quarts in a gallon. So you get three times more for three more bucks. Just makes perfect sense. Like, my dad was like, "Oh, why didn't you get a small one?" I'm just like, "That's so small, and it's smaller than this one, which is like the eco shit, which is like ten bucks." That's all they sold at Pet Boys in one day. <laughs> Get working on some shit and clean up. Thought I saw something. Nope. I think that's it, YouTube. I think I'm gonna leave it there. Oh, wait, now here's an addition to my. It's so dark. Let me pull my flashlight. Here's my shadow. Got the shitty lighting. It's my new edition. Oh, Christmas edition. Campbell Hossfield, two horse pa I mean, two gallon, 110 max. Has a slow ZFM. From zero to 20 PSI, that's like 30 seconds. It's so slow. I use it for airbrushing mainly. 
It's like 82, like 85 bucks or something. Really good. Oh, I gotta show you my little push motor update. You always gotta have that in your vids. Redneck idea yesterday. Yes. The fuck. Got the got that hooked up. Um, got the air filter on there. It's it's weird. I got this new carburetor. It's a better one. I had it actually. I got fuel line for it. And every time I hit the primer, it comes out the air cleaner. And I and I don't have it on backwards. But I put some um. I put the. Air filter housing, I'll put the um, instant gasket. Probably need to put another coat. I'm not sure. I never checked it actually yet. And here's another little quick tip. Look, I keep stepping on the shit and bending the prongs. Here's a quick tip for anybody looking to replace fuel line. Buy this stuff. It's like, what size is it? It's 3 8 diameter. See, here, I'll give you it. See? It's it's like a little small, but like if you push it on hard enough, you don't need these clips, which like slide right over it. But this is like 42 cents a foot. I got three feet, and I told you I got two feet, so you know, saved the uh, 42 cents or whatever. I got some flywheel keys. Not really. I think that's about it think that's about it oh yeah I want to oh ask somebody's um idea on this uh little motor it's a ooh. yeah I need to fix the wiring but it stop spinning it's a little um I get a little back farther it's a weed whacker motor got this thing on here I was thinking of building like I don't even know it's you know 120 volt I think it's a third horsepower. It's really, you know, it's a glee whacker. It's been really fast, but I don't know how much torque they got. I don't think they got really that much. But I want to have people's ideas on what to do. I was thinking maybe getting like a box fan and replacing the motor with this. So in the summer, like when it's really hot out, like in the hundreds, when it's like 100 degrees or 99 or whatever. I'll sweat my balls off. So I was thinking of having souped up or I was maybe gonna make a friction drive like bike or something. I was thinking of doing with the gas motor, I'm not sure. So to get your guys like, you know, um idea on it. To uh see what I should do. So see you later, YouTube.